Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Billy with Craft and Cake with Billy. I am super excited to have you here today. Um, if you are new here to my channel, I would like to welcome you here. I'm so happy you decided to spend a few moments with me. And if you have been here crafting with me for a while, welcome back. So I thought I would take a moment to show you what I have been working on. Um, I have a lot more coming, but I wanted to share with you um, the first ornament that I just made. And it is full of bling and pearls. And you guys know this is my style. I love the pink. I love the sparkle. I love the daintiness. I love the femininity. Is that, am I saying that right? <laughs> anyway, I love... I just love that pink and the shimmer. It just makes me happy. So I used one of the ornaments, the wooden ornaments from Hobby Lobby that I showed in my last haul. I will link it below if you haven't seen it. And I painted it pink and I just added all sorts of yummy, yummy, yummy bling to it. So I added pearls, I added um, the little berry beads, I added some brooches, just whatever sparkled and made me happy. That's what I put on here. So this thing is heavy, but I love it. And during the Christmas season, you know, I, I decorate my tree in pink, my she shed tree in pink. Um, so this will definitely be going on there this year. And I know a lot of people may not like pink, but I do. And you don't have to make these in pink. You can make them in whatever colors you like. That's the wonderful thing about crafting. You make it your own. So I just took a hot glue gun and I added whatever I found at arm's reach and um, just glued them on. And then I added some pretty, actually I added a burlap flower down and then a pink bow with another brooch. And then I used some trim to um, put through the hole there for a little thing to hang, you know, the little. But this is what it looks like up close and it's so beautiful and sparkly and heavy. <laughs> so there was my first ornament. And then those of you who are in love with gingerbreads, this is my second one. So this one is also made out of the ornaments from Hobby Lobby, the wooden. I flipped it upside down and I added a um, clothespin here so you can still see the, I need to cut that off. But anyway, I think I'll do that now. But I turned it upside down and I glued a clothespin to it to make it look like a lollipop. And these are the little faces that I drew. If you guys remember me doing the um, gingerbread faces, I'll link that video below. And I took some of the candy cane twine or rope and I glued it to the outside and then one on the inside and then I added that cute little face look at that cute face oh my goodness and then I added a burlap bow with a button and a flat back pearl in the center and then I took a cute little burlap flower and I made a gingham bow and then I used that cute little gingerbread that I found at Hobby Lobby. And then I took some trim and I wrapped it around the clothespin. And then I added another cute little gingerbread. He's hanging on to the bottom. But I couldn't just leave one gingerbread there. He needed a friend. So I added him there but I think they turned out super cute. And I have several more to come, but I wanted to share with you 
the first two and I hope that you like them. Um, if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please take a moment and do so. We have a lot of fun here and I would love to have you here as a crafty friend on my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, I hope you have a super awesome day. All right, bye.